The design of the CDC60 user interface is a combination of classic analog console layout and latest state-of-the-art gesture-based touchscreen navigation. So if you're from a background familiar with analog consoles, we're presenting you with some very familiar strip light channels which are very intuitive and very easy to find your way around. The console's graphical user interface makes great use of the concept of hidden till lit. The console only shows you information which is relevant to what you're doing, so you're not confused by being presented with lots of information which has got no data, no value, and is merely a distraction to mixing. For people who have never used an analog mixer, the gesture-based navigation makes it very simple to find your way around the desk because everybody uses these navigation methods on their smartphone, their tablet, their laptop. So wherever you come from, it's very easy to get yourself uh, up to speed very quickly on the CDC6. Navigating the CDC6 is as easy as operating your smartphone or tablet. The touchscreen enables you to scroll through the console. The faders align themselves with the channel strips on the screen and then I navigate to whichever area of control I want simply by touching the appropriate point on the screen. So I direct access into the EQ window, direct access into any of the dynamics processing, direct access into any of the bus assignments. Uh, another good thing about touchscreen navigation is that as well as using the rotaries to address the parameters on the screen, I can also use the screen itself to adjust the EQ. So either using the rotary encoders or simply by touching and moving a point on the screen, it's very easy to EQ, apply an EQ curve, however you want.